Hello guys, it is T Vespace here back in the Persona 5 for real video. So I literally have a deadline where I have to beat Persona 5 for real today because the game is not allowing me to save. There's a bunch of errors currently going on, um where my mouse keeps putting itself into the game for whatever reason. So I keep switching from Xbox controller to mouse and keyboard for me. Which we had that problem once before. In order to fix it, I had to exit and relaunch the game. Sadly, we can't currently do that because I would lose a bunch of progress if I did. So we're gonna go here, go shopping district. Oh, we have a million yen. Did not realize that until now. So yeah, we're kind of stuck. We can't leave the game. Uh, we can't save the game. There's a catchy. We don't care. I don't know why it brought us here. Anyway, um... Welcome. Sell all of our clothes. 103,240 points. Prizes. Clothing bag. Cool. So if any of that is better than what we currently have equipped. Uh, this is. Plus magic, cool. Pretty HP, we can give that to Ryuji. Oh boy, Here's, your stuff sucks. Let's go through and see if everyone has better stuff. Should only be outfits and nothing else that people have better of. It's all worse. Futaba doesn't really matter. Because Futaba doesn't actually fight. So, yeah. Anyway, let's give you a better accessory. Uh, what's Ketchy's? Okay, what is a Ketchy's weakness? And Samurai. Um, bless, so we can give you your item back. Where's this curse? Do so I have an item that, like, nullifies bless that we can give to a Kitchi? this and then we want to give the exact same thing to her and there we go now they are immune to everything we have a few of these that we could give starlight like glove do You can keep that. Now we're gonna go to the aerosol shop. Sell all the outfits we're not using. Maybe Sheesh. buy some more. Yo. Okay. I guess that's fine. You should be grateful. 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 I guess that's fine. Now it's on to 37. Uh, I guess that's that. fine. You should be grateful. I 
guess that's fine. Okay. All right. All right. Which one? Okay, you have Sounds the good. best. Hmm, that one. You better not use it to pull a prank. That's what you're choosing. Don't break it, okay? Hmm, you better not use it to pull a prank. That's what you're choosing. Like it? Break it, okay? That's what you're doing. How's that? Mm, that one, you better not use it to pull a prank. That's what you're doing. Break it, okay? Cool. So, now we got okay. all that. Alright, which one? It's worse. Even though it gets dry in the winter, be careful. Guns are prone to misfire if it gets too humid. Okay, but what's it? All right, sounds good. Without the customization. The air is dry. Mm, that one. Take your time. That's what your sure thing. Three twenty. Even though it gets mm, that good. Okay. All right. Which one? The air is dry, so be careful when you're handling gunpowder. That's what you're choosing. Do I get? Hmm. That was that. Um. No. We're not gonna That's mod anyone's like weapons. It? that that's what you're choosing you better not use it to pull a prank mm, that one do you like it how fast you can spend you change your mind? all of your yen mm, how's that already spent more than half our yen all right sounds good Be sure to choose carefully. Just don't go using it for anything. Huh? You change your mind or something? Okay, come again. Okay. Already spent a crap load of mint again. Hmm. Please head to the exam room. Spent slightly over, uh, like a okay. hundred. Okay. Which one? Well, way over five hundred thousand. Anyway, Some um. Some people think you can recover from a cold faster if you don't take any medicine. Revives all. But I recommend taking something to tell. Oh, did you decide? Let's get a few of these. Here you go. Stores 50%. That's safe from though. Don't you have four heels? No. That should work. Thanks. You want that one? Here you go. Take care. Okay, now let's go to Hifumi. We can't up, but still we should hang out with. Good evening. The end game speed. Okay. Um. 
textbooks. Oh, we're going for textbooks again. Go. Okay. I'm just gonna skip. Uh, must be ready for any opponent, no matter how strong. Uh, it's not going to be easy to find. Give it to me. Happened to be what she wanted to hear. King piece. Cool. Got a memento. Please take my exams for me. How do you even know the Phantom Thieves are smart? My, I could fail your exams for you. Uh, so I have one book that increases guts. It's my only non-maxed out stat. Oh, look at that. Guts is now maxed all right. out. Uh, maxed out all social stats. Get an achievement for that. It's not, probably not a rare achievement. Senpai? Good morning. Mm. Secured a route to treasure now. Just wait. Go to Mementos? Nope. You have no reason to go to Mementos, but... Besides... Getting the last of the well seats from Maruki's palace, but we can't do that yet. We have to actually beat Maruki before we can do that. I wonder if there's some sort of a thing that happens to get all the well seats. We're not gonna do that. Game? Sometimes it just likes taking a while to load. This request kind of caught me, caught my eye on the fan site. An ID, indie idol tricked my dad, and now my family is falling apart. It's that idol's fault that my mom and dad fight all the time. Mom got really mad today. She was shouting about that about them heading for divorce. Just want mom and dad to be happy again. So you get the picture. I think this poster is just a little kid. Makes all this crap hit a little harder, you know. Uh, so we're some idol. Yeah, I was wondering about that too, so I did some digging. Her stage name's Star Lee, Lee, Lee now. Honestly though, she seems pretty unlovable. No shady business, no cheating the fans, nothing. No hits on the nav either. Bad to guess, I'd say it's the dad who's the problem in this one. Sound like he goes by Akihabara every day. Wanna check it out? Mm. Okay. Need his name before we can do okay, anything. Let's go. Ryuji, how are you the only person who has sent me a request and has failed to get the hey, full hey. name? Um, good idea to relax and play some darts? No. <laughs> yeah, it has to tell me it can't say. Ugh, okay. Hang out with Kasumi. I mean, Samire. Gosh, dang it. She's at the start. Yes, my game can't save, can't make this save system data or whatever. And so, yeah, that's why I have to beat the game today. <sighs> mm. I want to talk to you about something, you have time. Can thank you. you? Uh, can we go somewhere? Can we go elsewhere? A bit difficult to talk about it here. School, really? Uh, senpai? I am so, so sorry. Seeing me trying to act like Kasumi must have been painful and awkward for everyone. Everyone must have noticed that I was acting strangely. They were probably being nice to me knowing I lost my sister. But even then, I had no idea I was even supposed to be sad. I didn't remember that my sister was gone. When my coach told me to think about who I really am, I thought it was just figurative. Something about my slump. I was just living my life like I didn't even care that she was gone. Can't take this shame. Uh... Was it on purpose? But... Well, yes, but even then, how can I forgive myself? Ever since we were kids, Kasumi was always the one who decided what I did, what I chose, where I went. I couldn't do anything without her. I suppose it's clear why my grades weren't going up much. I was never on Kasumi's level to begin with. So prestentious, so wrapped up in my own stupid little problems. I was too self-absorbed to do anything. 
Uh, what do you do now? Can I talk to you? Starting to remember things from our past now. It's hard, but I'm trying. There's a lot. It covers everything. Starting from when Kasumi and I first got into gymnastics up until re just recently. I want to talk about how it used to be for Kasumi and me. Would you listen? Um. Kasumi started gymnastics really early. I was even younger, so I copied her in almost everything. I went to class too. I was too little to really understand the sport or the rules, but everyone phrased, praised me when I did well. The coach would give me little rewards like ice cream cones. We did our best trying to learn the moves and routines since it kept getting us ice cream. <laughs> All for ice cream, huh? Yes! <laughs> I guess so, but clearly it worked, right? We worked hard though. We earned that ice cream. We would talk and laugh. Those days were so fun. And one day, around when I, we started going to junior meets, Kasumi asked me, If we can be number one in the world, does that mean we get all the ice cream we could eat? All with a straight face, of course. She could be really funny sometimes. <laughs> so obviously I told her, Kasumi, you're a super genius. Uh, that is genius. She really was a genius, though. Every day, came, everything came so easily to her, and every day, she only got better. You remember what my coach said, senpai? That my, well, that Kasumi's greatest weapon was her boldness? Kasumi was always so bold. She was like a beacon of confidence. So. And one day, I realized I'd never catch up. It didn't matter how hard I tried. I'd have consolation prizes for the rest of my life. Kasumi was always the one up on the podium, but even when she won her ice cream, she never ate it without me. I always told her not to worry about me, but she still said she'd wait until we could enjoy it together. She really believed in me. She said we'd be the best in the world someday. She had her own practices to do, but she was always so busy helping me. She spent hours trying to help me. For the ice cream, right? She cared about you. She was so kind and strong. She was the perfect older sister. I... Sumi's kindness was so, so infuriating. Why? She was always the one on the podium, surrounded by flashing cameras. But all I could do was watch from the shadows. I'm not Kasumi. And no matter what I do, I'll never be like her. If she just given up on me, it wouldn't hurt so much. At least then people would stop trying to compare us. What about Kasumi's feelings? I'm sorry. You're right. I suppose I was just selfish in the end. The thought kept coming back. Every day, my mind went back to it. Everyone would be better off if I didn't exist. Either that, or I should just be Kasumi. She's the one people really want. Samira, Samira is the one who's useless, pointless. Who would care if she died? But my sister died instead. Why does she have to protect an idiot like me? I, I watched her. Uh, you have to accept it. You're yes. I'm done running away. Senpai. Senpai, I can't stop here. Now I want to keep doing gymnastics as Samira. I want to hit those heights Kasumi was aiming for. Otherwise, I'd never be able to face her. Please, listen to me. Please, will you keep going out with me now that I'm sorry? What? That is worded so wrong. I want to hold. I want you to hold me to this to make sure I don't run away from who I am again. If it's part of the deal. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'll try to make sure it's worth your time. Eh, you must think I'm pretty lame. But I guess that's Sumire, the one that's who I am. I have to be stronger, both in my hurt and with my gymnastic skills. Maybe some other time. But for now, I'm Sumire Yoshizawa, and it's nice to meet you again. Okay, she's now getting the attacks. Oh, fitness talk. I got two new builders. Alright. 
just getting the attacks that all my other party members have. Phew. I feel so much better with all that, of that off my chest, senpai. I think this really helped me. Now I can focus on turning over a new leaf and doing my best. Shall we go? Let's go some let's get some practice in until I have to go to club. We'll be training even harder than before, senpai. Be extra strict from now on. Okay. Stamina has right. increased. See when you say stamina, I think SP not HP. Uh, hello. I'd like to thank you for what happened earlier today. And I'm sorry you had to see such a pathetic side of me. As soon as I acknowledged myself as Samire, gymnastics training started to fall apart too. But this is the real me, I guess. <laughs> so what if it is? Huh? I... well... Hehe, <laughs> haha. You know, you're right. So what if this is who I am? I made up my mind to keep moving forward, even without Kasumi. Can't just run and hide now. I'll think about where Kasumi got her strength from, and what I can do as Samire. I'll calm down, think all of this through. Thank you for listening to all that. Okay, talk to you again soon. Yep, I know, you can't save. It's cool. Well, I mean, it's not pure, but that's fine. I don't really care that much. I um, can't hang out with anyone. Just hang out. We'll just make hurry. Uh. Hmm. Oh, great. It's okay. We'll make coffee. Smoothness. No mistaking it. This Hawaiian corner. Let me explain. A Hawaiian treat because of the rarity and price of Kona beans. Kona blend only needs to contain 10% Kona beans. 100% Kona coffee roast is quite expensive. Good Kona coffee is known to have a rich flavor, right? Acidity and complex aroma. <sighs> flavor profile is bland. Yeah, we don't need to hear about people talking about how happy they are. Hi, everyone. How far do we? Oh. Sure. Oh, give me yes. twelve items. Oh boy, there's a lot of lock picks we won't use. Hmm. And we can't do no game plus with this save. Uh, I'd have to reinstall the game, uninstall the game, and reinstall it, and somehow fix the cloud saving on Xbox. Hey, have you guys heard of this I AI mask guy? Well, AI mask OZ, I guess some extreme video streamer with a robot mask and a big audience. We've got a request on the fan site for someone who knows him in real life. One of the streamer's friends? Apparently they want him to stop streaming himself going around doing borderline illegal stuff. When anyone tries to talk him out of it, he flips out and gets violent to say he's out of control. Do we have a name? A real name? Yeah, about that. He says he's not going to post the guy's info online. Guess this guy has made a lot of people mad. If he got doxxed, things could get ugly. So, we only have his title then, or screen name, or whatever. Can we get more hints? Looking at his archives now, a lot of these streams seem to be in Kochi Joji. If we checked around, maybe talk to some students, we might learn something. Students, huh? So our best shop is probably weekday afternoons. Isn't the only place he visits? Couldn't hurt to check other locations too. Let's, look, let's all look around. 
You mean me? Huh, <laughs> yep. Mm. Borderline illegal stuff to goofy mask. Cramping our style and making life hard for people. Gotta shut this guy down for their sakes too. Yes, I get it. You can't save. That's fine. I hope to beat the game so that I don't actually need saving. I should just title this. Can I be Persona 5 without saving? Oh, Daba. Gosh dang it, guys. You guys want me to hide out or something? Okay. Having no confidence up here at all is a bit weird. Hey! Uh. Sure. Could send a card and card, but that will literally end. Huh? Okay. Hmm. What do you want to do? Hey, hey. Oh. See, so, what do I want to do? It's gonna gray out everyone who's not maxed out. So these are all the people we still have yet to max out. Uh, let's do Futaba. Kill. Snowing. I make curry. Oh my goodness. Shoo. Finally. What do you want to do? Make sure you close up. Let me explain. So you're good at honey. Uh and I can add depth to curry's flavor profile without weakening the spice. But through the dish, curry the effect. Never thought honey would go so well. Spicy curry, something new every day. Throw it all together with such gusto. Secret to getting his confidence. Didn't expect yes, that. All right. Two. Second boss of the blonde got a, a, a wharf. Uh, that's. Cool, I guess. That award isn't gonna be saved. Uh huh. Class is starting. Sleeping. Uh, no featherman. Sentai series teach you about justice. Watching across the day. Speaking of which, did you know the concept of justice is different in Western culture and Eastern culture? Yeah. This is a statue of the goddess Themis. She's commonly referred to as the god of justice. She holds a set of scales and a sword, and she's stepping on. What's the thing. answer? She's stepping on. Toto. Oh, a snake. Weird. This is it. <laughs> Wonderful. That's correct. Our stories tend to paint snakes as symbol of sin or some kind of agent of evil. In Western culture, justice tends to be about enforcing the rules. If you want everyone to live in harmony, rules are absolutely necessary. So anyone who disrupts those rules might just end up like this snake. Eastern culture, on the other hand, views justice more like acting and thinking ethically. This exists in the individual. In other words, all humans have their own sense of justice. It's not an easy way to live, but I'm sure you will all be fine. Oh, time's almost up. So about your homework? None for today. Get some rest, but make sure you're awake for the next class, alright? Aren't you the guy? You're the guy that throws chalk at me all the time. No way. Oh, because he said he let them sleep. I didn't realize that until now. Uh, if we go all the way back up. Hey, you, are you sleeping? That's fine. Let him sleep. As soon as a busy stone will be tired. Yeah. Get it, shivers. 
can only Doge talk. I mean, it's like, kids these days don't respect their elders. Hey. Don't care that you can't say it's your own fault. So Haru or Futaba or Sumire or Sheena. I don't really care about Sheena too much. Oh, see. Haru is the closest, to be honest. But this would get her to rank 9, I think. Shuck. See. Come to see you. Thank you. She hit this will get a rank nine. Hang out. Be able to express myself here there with me. Oh yeah, you're contacting him. Cool. So you like me to try these? Yes. Please, if only a taste. This wasn't made with particularly expensive beans, nor was it brewed by any sort of coffee expert. Hmm, this flavor. Interesting. Anyway, what is it you wanted to discuss with me? Does it concern the company? My apologies for bothering you at such a busy time. It's not a problem. Um. The truth is, after my father's passing, I couldn't bring myself to trust anyone in Akuma Foods. See, that includes you, the Kakua-san. That's quite cool. I'm sorry. My apologies. Now then, um... Uh, what I wanted to discuss is... Uh, leave it yourself. <laughs> right, I'll be okay. Um... To Kakura-san, what do you think of that coffee? I grew the beans in my own garden, and even handled the preparation. What? I honestly don't believe it's a particularly good cup of coffee. But I put my heart into making it. That's why I asked you here today, Ta Takakura-san. Getting a second taste now. He knows she made it. Mm. I'm not suggesting we need to put this level of effort into the Kumara Foods coffee chain. And I'm not suggesting we should put a halt to the plan either. However, I won't let my company serve low-quality food to our customers. You know... This is very similar to the coffee your grandfather used to make. Excuse me? What? I used to be a regular at his cafe. That's actually how I ended up joining the company to begin with. To be honest, I was strongly opposed to closing the cafe, but I didn't have the power to make that decision at the time. I was planning on naming the new chain after a shop to make up for that though. I'm going to create a business that is loved by customers and employees alike, just as his cafe was place where people can come to drink in the subtle joys of life. Is that so? Aru-chan, I believe you have every right to just trust us. After all, things would have turned out differently if someone had chosen to stand up to your father. Be that as it may, I can truly sense the passion you put into this coffee. It seems you really are like your grandfather. No. I- I'm sorry for being so rude. I must apologize as well for encouraging you to abandon your shares. I thought they would be a burden to you, but I was clearly wrong. Aru Jen, if you'd like, why don't you take part in our next company meeting? Me? The truth is, the rumors of my being placed in your father's death were troubling to say the least. I understand not everyone agrees with the vision I have for this company, but I've spent great effort struggling against our board of directors to push Kumar Foods back on the right path. What I need is to communicate that thought as clearly as possible. Just as you did with this coffee. Do you think you could assist me in accomplishing that? Let's rebuild this company from the ground up. Um... Well, um... Give it all you've got. Yes. Uh, okay. I would be glad to join you. Excellent. Your grandfather would be proud, as would your father. By the way, the coffee was superb. You have my Thank thanks. you very much. Ah, 
and it seems I made yet another misunderstanding. I was under the impression that you were quite thrilled about the arrangement with Shuki Murakun. That is why I was so insistent on hurrying the marriage. I wanted you to have all the support you needed, but it appears as though you prefer the young man next to you instead. Huh? Ha <laughs> ha? Uh... Be honest, Haruchan. What are your thoughts on Suki Murasa Muakun? Um. I think he's an intelligent man, but I have no interest in him. I have no interest in being his wife either. I'd prefer to walk my own path. One in which the person in control of my actions is me, not my father, and not Suki Murakun son. I understand grown so quickly, Arachan. Didn't realize you became such a strong, kind, mature woman. My apologies for not going to see that sooner. But what about the contract Suki Mura-san made with my father? He said the reparations will be immense if I refuse the marriage. I haven't heard a thing about this contract. Have you seen the document? Excuse me? Huh? Well, now that you mention it, no, I haven't. And neither your father nor our lawyers have mentioned it to me. It seems he was lying, and may have had the help of particular people within the company. You see, those who don't agree with my vision brought him into meetings with the hope that he would eventually take over. However, we don't need a politician in our midst, particularly considering the humble roots of our corporation. As for the marriage cancellation, I'll handle it. It may take some time, but it will be done, I promise. You have my Thank you. thanks. I joined the rest of his coffee before heading home. Today was a huge success. I was able to tell Takakura-san how I feel and he actually understood. Not only about the company, but about Tsukimura-san as well. I was so afraid. But now that it's over, I think it was honestly pretty simple. I only made it to this point because you were with Thank me, though. You. Thank you, Renkun. You did amazing. You did too, you know. <laughs> anyway, um, I only started trusting people again because you were by my side helping me. So, I want to return the favor. Please confide in me if you ever need help. I'll be there for you. All right. Oh, that reminds me. Takakura-san said he said something a little strange, didn't he? <laughs> that that I like you. Goodness, why would he say that? Uh, yeah, I'm already in a relationship. What do you think? Solace is good friends. Yes. Uh, okay. You're probably right. I mean, that's all we are, so... Why are you so disappointed in that? Uh, anyway, uh, I should go study. Ventrix exam's coming up, so I don't really have time to be sitting around um. here. But, uh, thank you for today. Why are you so s- Oh, huh. guess I should out him. That makes it kind of hard to reject Haru. Cause it's like she's so sad if you say you guys are just friends. Sorry for the sudden call. There's something I really wanted to tell you. After we met, Takakura san told me my grandfather's plain recipe. I'm brewing some in my room right now, and it smells amazing. If only you could smell it too. Can't wait to try it. Yeah, too bad you can't smell anything over the phone. Can't wait to try, let you try some. I don't think I would have had the courage to do any of this if I was alone. I'd just given up without trying and never find out how Teko Takakura-san was feeling about all, any of this. So I hope you'll indulge your small gift for fighting at my side through it all. Okay, good night. Maybe shortage. Yeah, I have to make sure I know I can't save. Um. 
so yeah. Good evening. This bit can be more important than any previous. Did what I could prepare for the exhibition match, and so do you have some time? Feeling a bit anxious. What is our current relationship? All Eight. Right. Okay, you're gonna be nine. Thank you. After I confessed, I was scorned by the media, but everyone wants me to lose. However, I'm not going to give them the satisfaction. I'm going to win with these very hands. Uh, you can do it. That's... We shall see. But I'll do my very best. All this time, I have to go to the venue. You won't be able to go inside the match room. You can watch over the internet if you All like. Right. Now, I should be going. Aren't we gonna talk before your match or something? Gaston? Online broadcast of the match. I'm not gonna read this. I'll just let auto do its thing. And mute. Because I'm not even paying attention to this match. Sorry, guys. as if an ant had challenged an elephant. Shaggy players should know her limits. <sighs> that was the first time I have ever forfeited a match. So ashamed of myself. Didn't want to hurt the pieces any longer. A very cleanly decision. You remembered? One must concede defeat with grace, maintaining dignity until the very end, as a queen should. But I confess, I am confused. I mean, naturally I'm disappointed that I lost, but I still feel happy, as if a demon has been purged from me. The moment I realized that victory was impossible, I felt a strange peace. What's important is what I do from this point on. I played so disgracefully in front of you. Perhaps you can just view it as an example of what not to do. I understand that there are times which require one to forfeit with valor and grace. Toyo. Increases turn delay to zero. I need to instantly escape battle. Oh, nice. All right. I don't really need that anymore, though. Um. I've been thinking about this for a while. Let's make today your last lesson. Spending time with you has only brought you pain. Spending time with me has only brought you pain. I'm just thinking hard. Carefully what I'll say. So, this is goodbye. I want to become stronger. Things you say sometimes. Perhaps I should take a lesson from that ambitious nature of yours. <laughs> if that is what you wish, then prepare yourself. Your training will be quite intensive. There may be things I can learn from you as well. I suppose this is a friendly wyvern for both of us, as irreplaceable showy friends. Let's go home. Well then, let's go home. Thank you so much for today. I've been thinking this entire time about how things would have been if I kept playing Shogi according to my mother's strategy could have enjoyed a transient, empty success, but when I looked two, three moves ahead, I saw myself an assistant playing a purgatorial spy trick shogi, unable to 
ever win or lose. I probably would have ended up hitting Shogi, perhaps even given up on life. That's why I can't say with certainty. That's why I can say with certainty. Today's loss was not a setback, but a glorious step forward. Let's win the next one. Yes, I was just thinking the same thing. It's so encouraging to have someone who truly understands me. I'm so happy. Alright, I should go. But I'm looking forward to seeing you again. I was actually thinking about that. Oh, Futaba, Yusuke, no, mix up Haru. Let's see, Futaba or Yusuke? I can do Yusuke. Plus, Yusuke it tends to be funny. Being honest. Indeed. <laughs> mm. You remember director Kawanabi of the Japanese Art Sport Foundation, the man who offered his support to me at Manorami's house. I like your existence with them. Do you have time to spare? Thank you. That would really help me out. I find it quite suspicious that he would offer money to a mere high school student like myself. Grateful for his offer, but I'm unsure of what to do. That uh, meetup? Indeed. Yeah. Let's cling on to any semblance of hope I can find in this world. Very well, I will call him. He says he is willing to meet with me this very instant. Appreciate it if you could join me, Ren. Presence could help ease my societal discomfort as well as diffuse the temptation of money. Furthermore, your composure will allow you to tell if he truly is attempting to scam me. Let us be off. I was waiting for us at the sushi bar. I already told him that you will be coming, so let us go. Um, I've ordered your portion as well. Please eat freely. No. Before that, there's something I would like to ask. Just who are you? Hmm, an interesting question. My work involves gallery management, but my hobbies are diverse. The foundation is but one of those hobbies. Let me move my cursor. Broadly speaking, we're responsible for scouting and nurturing talented youth involved in the art board. We offer free scholarships meditate meditate study abroad programs and we also connect young artists to customers at a time even monorame participated in our organization sensei uh, i mean monorame indeed a good many benefited from his time working with us i don't know why i skipped there we were aware of the dark rumors about him but we could never have seen his confession coming I suppose it's likely he was deceiving us that whole time. <coughs> Matarame. I think I once relied on his teachings. Called him my mentor. This is all because of him. It is his fault. I know I can no longer view paintings with a pure heart. Hmm? In the past, simply the desire to paint led me to seek beauty. But now I find myself constantly weighed down by the search for the words of praise of others. How could this oh my god. An ugly attachment has fastened itself upon my work. I can no longer paint how I used to. to be. My art is tainted. I see. However, it would be wasteful to let your talent dry up. The foundation would gladly support you. Not only a former student of the infamous Madarame, but someone with those looks. There is definitely a market for you. 
We'll sell you as the tragic handsome artist. Uh, it's a great name, I guess. Huh? Tragic? What do you mean? Exactly as it sounds. Having your ideas stolen by Monorame, losing a place to live, hungry for food. That unstable air about you makes for the perfect tragedy. A story like yours will sell even to those who don't understand art. A story? If you don't have one in the modern climate, nobody will even mention your name. Don't worry, we'll handle the details, but in return, you must sell your work through my gallery. It will take a meditation fee. M or is it mediation? I don't. But you'll be granted steady revenue and a nice customer base as well. Do not mock me. How foolish. Tragedy, looks, story, must have nothing to do with art. In the end, this is only about money. That which taints pure beauty. How immature. Excuse me? It seems you haven't learned anything after all. You're not looking at reality objectively. Is wealth really that horrible? Beyond that, how long will you continue to chase those illusions of yours? Purity? Arts? I Sh decline. Shut your mouth. I reject your offer. Hmm. I thought you of all people would have the resolve to use art to make a living. Aren't you just- didn't you bring me here to make sure you weren't swayed by money? And what? You despise money? Okay, whatever. I have that resolve. Ever, I also believe such a life should only come via proper assessment. Hmm? In that case, I have an opportunity for you. Gosh dang it. My fat action will soon be holding a competition for young artists from around the nation. The prize shall be our support. We'll bring customers from around Japan to see the next great talent. There will be a great deal of pressure on you, should you enter, or perhaps are you too afraid? What did you say? I wonder if you have what it takes to understand a skill-based assessment of that magnitude. Look forward to finding out. Now then, it seems there's no use in any further discussion. You can have them send the bill to my office. You are unforgivable. Why is it that all artists talk about is money, money, money? Has the true meaning of art been lost? The truth is within you. Yes. You are correct. My passion can change the world. I wouldn't go that far. Ever, I would starve to death without money. Passion alone may fill my heart, but it cannot fill my stomach. What a troubling predicament. You have Anyhow, things. I'm quite glad that you chose to accompany me here. I may have bit my tongue off in anger, had it been only me. You're dead with me here, though. In other words, you're a soothing force in my life. I'm not sure about that. But whatever you say, whatever you would like to think, you scared. You can say I use card duplication, card recreation on the spot. All right. Nice. Okay. All right. I will partake in the exhibition. I'm going to display my ability and prove him wrong. Come, let us go home. Hmm. Actually, we should eat first. Sushi has done nothing wrong after all. Let us return okay, home. Okay, now let's head home. <laughs> I need a pep talk. It's good that I'm sitting in front of canvas while my emotions are brought. Lingering taste of sushi has me utterly distracted. Not only that, loud Kawanabi to pay for it all. Tainted after all. Pretty s petty set out. A slave to the power of money. Not a crime to enjoy sushi. Uh, I suppose that sushi was truly delicious. They didn't list the price for some reason. I can only imagine it was quite expensive. Certainly, sushi can be a form of art. When it's prepared with such care and art, artis, art, artisanal craftsmanship. If I'm being honest, I still feel doubts about my work. I may end up embarrassing myself again. But even then, I must express myself. Your support in this world... Your support in this would mean the world to me. Goodbye for now.
shall we do? Here we go. Oh boy. What do you think? Just hang out with him anyway. Planetary, I'm sure. Sorry guys, I'm skipping all this. Uh... Want me to teach you? He wants to educate his son. Using the planetarium or something, I don't know. Thieves rock, but I don't know. Come help me out? No, we can't actually. Deal with it. Help yourself out. Anyway, we max all our social stats. We're not gonna max it all in the confidence of the way we're going. Uh, how many days do we have? Eleven? Cool. Yeah, so we're not gonna max out all the confidence. Oh, we can max out Harry right now. Let's go do that. At the rooftop. I should actually have been planning. Oh, sorry, I didn't read what she said. Should have been planning vegetables and whatnot, but I haven't. Thank you. Like to drink a nice cup of boss's coffee. Can we hand tell the blind? Oh, this should all be voiced, by the way, because it's her final scene. Or most of it should be voiced. Not sometimes, not all of it, just voiced like Ons. Hi. This has such profoundly bold flavor. I heard you've been getting into the roasting scene, little lady. Yes, I often have the urge to drink a fresh cup of your coffee. <laughs> that near brings a tear to my eye. Well, I'm heading home now. Close up shop for me, will you? Sure. Wait, you're heading home, Arlie. I was finally able to convey my feelings during the company meeting, not just about the new chain, but about the future of the company, and even about father. I think my presence angered some people at first, but in the end, they all listened to my thoughts. Done great. All that nervousness was exhausting. I've had diplomatic dealings with VIPs before, but I've never once spoken my true feelings. That aside, after talking with management, I've decided to let them handle Okumura Foods. It's simply not something I would have been able to supervise on my own. And after their sincere acceptance of the public's criticism, I felt it was okay to trust them. As for my future goals, I'm interested in opening a small private cafe. Everything will be homegrown. From the coffee to the salad, I want to set my own standards. It'll be a shop that people love, like grandfathers, and like this place. What do you think? I'm sure you'll succeed. It's a pretty boring dream, huh? Depends when on your you ask. That, I feel like it will actually happen. Truth be told, I don't plan on opening the shop immediately after I graduate. I'll need to study and improve my knowledge beforehand. After all, right now it's only a hobby. Perhaps I should apprentice here at Leblon in the meantime. Sure. If you want. The coffee I had after spending the night crying. Its warmth permeated through my body. I hope to open a store where others can feel that warmth. Either way, I think this dream of mine will be no easy feat. Nope. But I somehow managed to tackle my childhood dream of becoming a heroine of justice. If I act with resolve and believe in my actions, I know I'll be able to achieve anything. I'm so glad I met you. At first, it was nice having someone that understands me. But now, it's much more. There may be times where people resent me for it. 
But as long as you're here, I'll be okay. You know, I'd like to return the favor. If you ever find yourself in trouble, I'll be there for you. Feel free to rely on me from now on. I have the strength to help you. I can sense it. Cool. I am thou. Thou. I'm just gonna kind of skip this. It's the same every time we've seen it for so many confidants, huh? Uh -uh. Alright. You're gonna have to mother heart it. So this is her second form. I don't think we're gonna lock her third form. Um, oh, that's interesting. I've never seen her second form. I feel as though I've been reborn. This is my new power. Kind of reminds me of Day of the Dead, like All the right. like face paint and stuff they do for Day of the Dead. I start uh, Ash. I start the. Not the English sounding. When I open my cafe, I'll let you be my first customer. Yay! I'll bring you a present. <laughs> I can't wait! My, look at the time! We've been speaking for quite a while. I should be going now. Take care. Retire to the station. Evade nuke. Oh yeah, you now nullify so we can get rid of that. Dang it. Alright, who's here? Oh yeah, the card represents people that are maxed out too. I was like, who's here? Everyone here is maxed um, out. Yeah, I forgot. It tells me if people that are maxed out want to hang. Also, which you don't really want to hang with them. Waste of time a little bit. Who? Okay, there's you for me. Ugh. Things work, so we can just max out for me. Then we can focus on. Here we go. The last night person. Come on. Good evening. Um. Hey, match. Oh, you want to go to the hotel place or whatever? I don't know. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, we're just gonna skip everything. Now, shall we plan our plan of attack? See what you've got. Going to mementos. Uh, what? Public's been acting kind of weird lately, huh? People around me are talking differently now. They're really weirdly optimistic. It's the same thing in town too. Everyone seems restless. Possible. Thanks. I guess it hasn't happened to everyone yet. We don't change Dr. Marcus' heart by the deadline. We're not even going to. Realize that something's wrong anymore. We have to win, no matter what. Apparently there's an alternate ending where you can accept Maraki's reality. Apparently. Obviously that would be with you and Akechi. Oh, have you heard? Uh English lane is constantly evolving with the times. Textbook English is more static, it's so lame. To 
Sometimes you can work out the meaning behind slang through context clues. Some are just natural extensions of English language constructs that have already been in place for years. Others might combine normal words or use more common phrases in new or unusual ways. Take thirsty, for instance. Originally, it describes a need for a drink. That's a pretty serious need, right? Better slang, it describes someone who's a little too desperate, like a boy who won't stop asking you out. Okay, kind of right, kind of wrong. It's more of someone who's desperate in a more romantic or sexual way, not just thirsty or not just desperate in general. Oh, and hangry. That's when you're so hungry you put you on edge and everything makes you mad. I need an answer. Okay, here's a test. Do you say you're feeling a bit salty? What would salty mean if used in slang sense? It's like slightly upset. <laughs> it was very um, popular. It's not as popular as it used to be. Uh, clues in the world? You could call someone sweet, right? Sweet is nice. Kind hearted. Uh, and it's pretty positive connotation. Salty is the opposite. Negative. Makes it two. People describe salty, salt overpowers everything else. Uh, I mean, some, someone's feeling bad somehow. It's probably something you can say about yourself or other people. It's like resentful. Nice. Yeah. This that was a very easy one. Because... What? It popped up when I was like in middle school or something, I think. At least that's when I started hearing people say it all the time. Slang can be rooted in many origins, common words, acronyms, and of course, for formenti what? Heard of the word friend of me? I have multiple times. It's friend and enemy. Think something like a rival or an enemy who acts friendly with you. Or you know a friend that you're a rival with. There's always like friendly rivalish. If anyone wants to learn some extra slang vocab, I would be positively psyched to offer some bonus lessons. Hmm. Enemies, huh? I've had enough backstab. You know what catches our friend of me? I hate him. He's not really my friend, but he's Joker's friend, so. Hmm. Hmm. Blow off some steam at the batting cages? I do not, actually. Uh, so. We don't have to ever come here again, unless it's to get Haru's second persona, well, third persona form, which I don't see us doing, being honest. Anyway, we're gonna hang out with Yusuke. Hey, how many days do we have? Ten. Indeed. Options to wait to the post dates. Wanna hang out with you. <laughs> Mulling over what he said to you. I would like to speak with you and the others. Do you have free time today? Sure. Indeed. Like other opinions as well. Oh, oh boy, what the freak? Sorry. Oh, it's just us. Apologies for calling you all here like this. Boss was even kind enough to serve his coffee before he went shopping. Whose book is that? A vital request? Hey! Hit me with your best shot. All the tough problems are gonna have to go to Ren, though. Hey! Mm, I can help with any subject that's not math. I thought you only could help with English. Do you too honestly believe I would ask you here to help in my studies? Tell the truth. The truth is, I'm planning to display my work in a competition. The one organized by, uh, you remember, yes, Ren? I must win and prove not only my ability, but my intense passion for art as well. However, I am having quite a bit of trouble determining what my next subject should be. Given this painting a fair amount of thought, but nothing has come to me yet. Hence, I was hoping to hear your opinions on an ideal subject. Oh yeah! How about you have- Oh my goodness, Ryuji, you pervert. Wait! Uh, how long are you gonna keep bringing that up? Anyway, maybe you should paint something people find pretty. That's mm. subjective on. So in the end, we return to the concept of beauty. Red, what subject do you think would most capture beauty? Uh, 
Morgana? Hmm? You think Morgana is beautiful? Uh, I suppose beauty is in the eye of the beholder. But honestly, him? People like cats. What's wrong with cats? Uh, why can I not paint a beauty as pure as the scenery? Where have all my efforts gone? Hmm. You know, I'm not really sure what you mean by pure beauty. I mean, yeah, it's a pretty painting, but I'm not sure I really consider it a pure beauty or whatever. Huh? Hmm? I don't know. I guess it just feels more gentle to me. Honestly, I almost cried the first time I saw this theory. It kind of felt like I was a baby again in my mother's arms. Watching over me, telling me everything's gonna be okay. That was the gentleness that painting made me feel. <laughs> this is coming from someone with absolutely no art knowledge, though. I see. Gentleness. That is yet another aspect this theory captured that I cannot. Is my heart too clouded? No way, man. It ain't cloudy, dude. Are you sure about that? Painting used to be all my heart desired. I need nothing. I needed nothing else in life. <clears throat> But now, what now? I've become overwhelmed with the need to prove myself to Kawanabi, to prove myself to the world. Look down on Madarame for focusing so sharply on fame and money, yet I too yearn for the praise of others. In truth, oftentimes I regret declining Kawanabi's offer. How could this be? Is that what pure passion is supposed to look like? Our head is clouded by worldly desires? Same applies to everyone. Yes, precisely. Everyone in this world is ugly and I'm no different. Everyone is... Wait a second. That means everyone is afflicted with the same ugliness I am? Yep. Ren's right, dude. Ain't nothing wrong about doing your best to make a living. Yeah. And you just want someone to acknowledge your work, right? That's some serious passion. How can passion be born from these repulsive thoughts? You think? Listen here, dude. I was totally like you back on the track team. I just wanted to prove myself. To win. To get all the goals to call me crap like Sak Sakamoto Senpai. But, you know, even through all that, I was trying to help my team out. Sure, it was a solo sport, but nobody's gonna run till they puke if they don't got teammates they want to inspire. I guess what I really want to say is... You gotta do stuff for people beyond just yourself if you want to succeed. I see. Mm. So how it is. So this is the seer gentleness held within the seer, the warmth of its heart. It's all for the sake of those who gaze upon it. How oh, interesting. So ah, I you see. Whoa. Huh? What'd you see? I've been a fool. Beauty is not the superficial thing I've long thought it to be. It is something that wills up within the heart until it breaks free. It is a gift given by a subject unto its viewer. Yes, finally see the truth. That's very kind. Three of you have my sincerest gratitude. Been a truly tremendous aid. Yeah. Uh, uh how exactly? We somehow managed to help you scale out. I like my bond with these guys growing deeper. We don't know how we helped them out, we just did. It just kind of happened on its own, you know? Like, right. with everything. It's Yusuke. Mm -hmm. Yes, the time has come for my brush to meet Gendrus in beautiful harmony. If you'll excuse me. Have fun, I guess. Oh boy. Man, he's acting even weirder than normal. That is the point of being weird, isn't it? I was pretty inspired though, so he'll be fine, right? Anyway, are you guys hungry? I might ask Boss to make me something once he gets back. Hmm, maybe curry this time. You know, I can Come make curry, on. right? You eat so freaking much. Oh yeah, what was that crap about being good at everything except math? It ain't nice to lie, you know. No. I wasn't lying, it's just really hard to get good grades at Shujin. No way, man. If you're not getting good grades, you should have no, and Yusuke wasn't gonna ask you to study with him. <laughs> <laughs> Honor Yuji and I enjoyed the rest of our time together. Thought as much. 
Okay. Why does it matter if you thought I'd be back soon? Anyway, can we hang out with you? We cannot. Oh boy. Yeah, we're waiting for the last day in order to do the thing with Maruki. That or Angelina Sheesh. might help a few more people. Don't work. Something I need to talk to you about. Good. Actually, listen up, kid. Figure it out. Weakness. When you and Karu were over at that diner, without getting info from a reliable source line. Turns out, I guess right. The one on the other end of that Hong Kong mafia deal. Apparently, he paid them off a huge arsenal of guns. <laughs> this is where things start getting interesting, though. He was smuggling all that crap in. Why would he come to me asking for modified guns? I mean, don't something about that seem off to you? Oh. He's gonna give the buyers or whatever fake guns and keep the real ones. Basically scamming. Absolutely. <laughs> right? Say that piece of crap trying to lord his position over me. But he ain't got crap now. What I'm really saying here is, I don't think those Hong Kong guys ever delivered on their end of the deal. Oh, the Hong Kong guys didn't deliver. He paid them money, so he's gonna give his ball spike weapons. Probably just took his money and flat out stiffed them on the guns. Masa told me something well real back when you, or when you guys were at the diner though. Hmm. Apparently, now it's been treating that Hong Kong transaction like some kind of massive business success. That means Testa's been lying to him this whole time. Now he's trying to use me to cover up his mistake. Rapty bastard. <laughs> oh, everyone's already known he's one sneaky son of a. <laughs> Don't matter now though. Everything's gonna change once I tell the clan what's up. Testa's not gonna be able to keep intimidating me anymore. Make sure Guamu Ka oh won't get enabled like I was. Be a regular, respectable adult. Something I could have never been, even never dreamed of. Wow. Gonna go talk to myself first, though. Gotta follow the Yakuza code. Yo. Hey, got a favor to ask. Anything happens to me, take care of Kaoru, okay? Okay. Come on alone? Probably. Don't. I know he'd be able to get rid of me, no problem. Without a witness there. But I gotta put an end to this. Besides, nobody would wanna wait a sec. Got you. That's right. I want you to come talk to Tusta with me. Tusta. He's not gonna deal with your finger on a civilian kid. It caused way too many complications for him. Come as my witness, things will be Good. miles safe. Right then. Settle. I I've been falling to old guys. Oh. Let me think of a word. Gotta thank you for the info and for being my witness. <laughs> How about I work even harder on that special menu? Should be good for you, yeah? Not really. No. I don't need anything from the special menu anymore. Oh boy. Well, I'll hit you up when it's time. Let's do this, kid. Later. Sorry guys, uh, videos subtly are getting longer, um, just because I literally were just playing the game non-stop right now, today. Yeah, thought that witness talk earlier. Remember, it's too late to get cold feet now, can't bear on me. But I'm obviously gonna look out for you, if it comes down to it, I personally take responsibility for protecting you. But considering you're dealing with, I can't afford to take any chances. Bring it on. Eh, you really do have guts. Guts alone isn't enough to get by in this world. Remember, nothing's that simple. Look, and I shouldn't be dragging a miner. I shouldn't be getting a miner dragged into this crap. But you're the only one I can rely on. Everything's prepped and ready. I'll give you a call later. Your help from the sidelines. Well. 
Shall we begin? Okay. What do we want to make this time? Oh, let's see. Of targeted chances of being targeted by foes for one ally. Greatly raises chances of being targeted by foes. I mean, that's pretty good if we have someone who's, say, uh, immune or like repels or attack or something, have a foe target them. Um, I don't care about that. And we can make this. So I got that. Hmm. I don't know anything about Murphy's balls. So, go ahead and blind here. May not be helpful, and I can't do new game plus anymore. So, it makes it just not helpful for this boss fight. It's useless for me. Snow coming tomorrow. Thank you, we'll get a real blizzard. Who knows? You rarely ever see heavy snow in Tokyo. It's a heavy snowball, but it's gonna be wet snow. So, we won't really fire it up much. Sources, some guy on TV. Oh no, my flower beds. I should go check on them. I'm sure, they'll be fine. But if you need help with them, I'll do what I can. Indeed, you do can as well. Man, you, just, you can't just volunteer me. <laughs> Not that I want it though. You need any heavy lifting done? I'm your guy. Actually, if the snow is going to be that bad, it might have some effect on the metaverse too. Might as well keep it in mind when we plan for tomorrow. We're not doing anything tomorrow in the metaverse, so what does it matter? On is just like, hey, doing stuff with Metaverse. Get with the program or get lost. Uh, I wonder what her other form looks like. I can hang out with her. She's a what son? Hey, hey. Uh, no, I'm not doing that. I could barely care less. No just want to beat the game. Uh, special programs into um, boxer sizing. Relieve really stress, open to public. Sure. Thank you so, Thank you so much. much. Introduce you to coach Hiraguchi san. What's my lesson ends? Using person, been guiding Kasumi and me since we were little. We should get going. Let's head over. Kasumi helped me through this special regimen several times. It gets tough after a while, your limbs start feeling heavier the longer you keep them up. Whenever we did this before, all I could focus on was how well Kasumi was doing and how much I wanted to stop. Kasumi was probably just so disappointed in me. I got tired out so quick. Are you frustrated? It's not that I was frustrated. I just felt so miserable that I couldn't match up to Kasumi. She never doubted herself for a second, and then there's me. Oh, I think it's almost time for my coach to show up. Kind of nervous. She's strict. Yes. You could say that. She's tough on us, but she's a great mentor. She's been helping to see me for a long time. Even though, even through all my stupid delusions, it's Kasumi. She never stopped helping me. I don't know what I'd do without her. Hello, Coach Hiwaguchi. Sumire, Sumire. Oh, wow. Sumire? Maybe it's just my imagination. You seem like your old self again. Uh, yes. I'm sorry I worried you. Uh, I've, I've been running away from what happened to my sister. So you realized. Are you okay now? Please, listen to I'm me. not totally back to my normal self, but I'm working towards a new goal. I want to be the best in the world. So now I'm going to do what I can as Samire. See? By the way, what's this? Oh, uh, this is my senpai from school. Both came here for a lesson. Oh, so you're... Fine. Let's have you go first, Samire. You can start with your combination. Uh, yes, yes. yes ma'am. Some amazing moves. 
that was so freaking fast. She's really got those aggressive moves done. She really is just like her sister. Okay, you can take a break. I'll do some more later. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you for bringing me here. Thanks for all your help today. How did I do? Tried to put some real force into that combination. You said you were going to perform as Smire this time. I didn't see that at all. Well, I saw it there was Kasumi. Or Shadow of her, at least. <sighs> what? Kasumi defined her performance by her boldness. Yes. But that's not something you can... Uh, you can appropriate for yourself. Came from the energy within her. That's what made her Kasumi. I told you to think about who you really are. Seems like you still don't understand what I meant. Oh. You need to stop hiding behind Kasumi. If you keep denying yourself like this, how can she still call you her rival? <gasps> What's that supposed to- I never wanted to draw attention to it, but Kasumi had a very competitive streak. She hated to lose. She'd always tell me, She's so jealous of her little sister and her delicate, graceful style. Can't lose to her, she said. She wanted you to see that. She she said that? That that's impossible. Kasumi could do anything and I I was nothing. I've said all I wanted to say, but I suggest you think a little harder about it. Okay, it's your turn now. Get ready. That was a big sigh. <laughs> sorry, couldn't help it. I'm sorry you had to see that mess earlier. Me? Graceful? Now that I think about it, I guess that's the one thing my coach used to compliment me on. But even then, that even with that, I couldn't match Kasumi's performance at all. And now she says Kasumi saw me as a rival. Don't believe it. I, I mean, all I was doing was imitating her. Even since the beginning, I was just following Kasumi. I was fine in the beginning. I loved being with Kasumi, and it was fun. But ever since I started noticing the difference in her gymnastic skills, one thing became clear. I'll always be someone less than Kasumi. I'm just worthless after all. I need more confidence. Yes. Well, yes, anyone can see that. Still, something occurred to me when Coach told me what Kasumi said. I realized, just like what she, just like she wanted to show me, she what she could do. I still want you to see my own abilities. You remember, like when I tried to show off back at the batting cages. <gasps> oh, maybe that's what I need to chase. Maybe that feeling can help me get some confidence. Sounds like even Kasumi liked my more subtle and delicate moves. So if I mix it with her aggressive style. I'll become stronger. Right? Maybe I'll be able to step up my routine. The key is showing on is showing you what I can do. Then I just need you to watch me again. Senpai, will you go out with me again? Uh another love confession. What? <laughs> uh, I mean uh love. <laughs> I didn't mean I mean uh I wasn't I didn't mean to. I was just hoping to get your help and and it. <laughs> She's so nervous. Wait, Senpai, are you just messing with me? <laughs> okay. But I hope you know, I really will be relying on you. Rank 7. Alright. I think about I'll think about what else I can do when I figure it out. I'll let you know. Oh, is it time already? Let's get going. All right. Good effort. Thank you so much for today. I'll see you next time. Well, Senpai, thank you for coming with me today. Uh, strict isn't he, she. She wasn't going easy on you at all. 
She used to make me Kasumi work so hard. So harsh, she even made me cry a couple times. Kasumi said she was probably tough on us because she stole our potential. Thanks to Kasumi supporting me with her strength, I kept working hard. It didn't seem like you were struggling at all though. You might be just as tough as Kasumi. Amazing. Uh, I love a good challenge. Oh, I see. So, you let the struggle fear you. I wish I could do that. I can't stop thinking about what she mentioned though. My own energy, huh? Guess I'm the only one who can find that answer. But I'll try with everything I have. For now though, I'll talk to you later. Okay guys, so that will be it for this video. I guess if you enjoyed, I can go and subscribe for our skills next video. Whatever, whatever that one might be. Alright, so.